Three, two, one. What's up, everybody? This is Aid, and welcome to me watching a DVD bounce around for one hour. So, this is a pretty long video, longer than most, but I mean, the video I made yesterday was also an hour long, so whatever. Um, anyways, I'm gonna be watching this thing bounce around. <sighs> I mean, Right now, I'm not that bored. I'm just talking to you, but it's only until about like 15 minutes in until I realize the full scope of what I'm committing to. <laughs> I mean, most people probably aren't going to watch until 15 minutes into the video, but still. Anyways, DVD video just bouncing around. Bang, bang, bang. Bang. I want to see it hit the corner. I mean, it started off in the corner, but I want to see it hit it again. Bam. Bam. It's not even close to the corner. Okay, that sucks. <sighs> it's orange, it's blue, it's yellow. This video is going to get really boring really fast because I have no idea what to talk, to, if talk about. It. I just, this is something that needs to happen in life. Honestly, these videos are some of my favorite videos to make. Like, I just get to, like, think and have my own thoughts for an hour. I just get to kind of think in my own brain space for one hour. <sighs> While watching something. Now it's like pinkish, hot pink, purple, cyan. It's all the colors of the rainbow. Whoa, whoa, is it gonna hit the corner? Is it gonna hit the corner? No, it is not because it's a jerk. Okay, now it's yellow. Oh, is it gonna hit the corner? Is it gonna hit the corner? Is it gonna hit the. So close! You're so close! You're so close! Wait, is it gonna hit the corner? Is it gonna hit the corner? Is it gonna hit the corner? It's gonna hit the corner. Oh! It didn't hit the corner. It became like orange for a split second. Ah! Okay, maybe this one will hit the corner. Hit the corner, hit the corner. No. Okay. Now. Okay, go down. And I think it's too high to hit the corner. Is it too high to hit the. Yes, it is too high to hit the corner because it sucks. Um. So. Um. Uh. Man, it's like 7.20. In the afternoon, I just, why did I do this? Why did this ever need to happen? Well, I mean, this never needed to happen, but at the same time, it really did need to happen. It just did. And it's happened. It's happened already. By the time you're watching this, I've already done the entire hour. I mean, I'm only a couple in minutes in by, the t by what I'm talking. But by the time you're seeing this, I've already done the complete hour. I've already rambled on, and I've already done... The things that have been done currently, I don't know what they are, but they've been done. They will be done. Uh, and by the time you're watching this, they have been done, if you know what I mean. Okay, okay, hit the corner, hit the corner, hit the corner. You did not hit the corner. That sucks. Why didn't you hit the corner? It's like a orangey red. It's pink, hot pink, purple. I think it follows like a pattern. Yes, yeah, cyan. And it becomes like orange, right? Yeah, and then blue, and then yellow, and then pink. Right, it becomes pink. And then, no, orange, pink, purple. So yeah, so it does follow a pattern. Pink, uh, uh, purple, um, cyan, orange, blue, blue, um, blue, yellow, I was gonna say that's oh, yeah, that's red. That's red. Red, pink, purple. Oh oh oh! Hit the, no, you didn't hit the corner. Ah. Ah. Okay, so I um I just wanted to say that. Oh my god. Okay, you're really close to hitting that corner, dude. You better do that sometime. Um, <clears throat> I just wanted to say that this video is kind of I've kind of wanted to make this video for kind of a while. Um, and I just never got around to it. Well, now I'm getting around to it. But it's Monday. It's a friggin' Monday and I'm doing this. Why? Could have done this on like a Friday where I had free time and stuff. And I have... These types of videos you should never make on a on a school day. But uh, here I am doing it. So, yeah. DVD video. I mean... The DVD logo bouncing around doesn't always have to be a DVD video logo. It could just be a regular DVD video, which is just a DVD with a disc. Because there... It, 
because the regular DVD logo is the same thing except the video part, the, the letters are gone, and it's just like a little circle in the middle of that big, it's like a little oval in the middle, the middle of that big oval to make it look like a disc. But this one this has letters and it says video, DVD video, which is just like movies and whatnot. I mean, I have quite a few DVDs. In fact, I made a video kind of a while back opening one. So that was pretty epic. Yeah, it was pretty epic. Um, anyways, while I'm here, might as well talk about myself. This is my channel. This is my video, after all. Pink, purple, cyan, um, orange, orange, um, blue, blue, yellow, yellow, and then red, red, and then pink. Okay, so I pretty much got the pattern down. Pink, purple, then blue. Or no, cyan, 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 then uh, blue. No, no, no. Wait, yeah, blue. No, orange, then blue. <laughs> Dang it. This is confusing, man. <laughs> and then yellow, and then um, red, and then per pink, whatever. Anyways, I'm going to talk about myself. Uh, first of all, what's going on with gaming on my channel? So, if you've been watching for like at least a couple months, then you've noticed that like the different types of games that I play are kind of different. I used to just play like, Clicker Heroes all the time and stuff. That was boring. I don't know why I did that, but now I just play Deep Dead Out all the time. Now that I think about it, nothing really has changed. But, <clears throat> sorry, this is going to be unedited for the most part. The only edited part is going to be the very end of the video where my outro plays, because, yeah, I like to have my outro playing. Um, so all coughs and snorts and sniffles and burps, sneeze, and farts are all going to stay in, so... Yeah, strap yourself in. <coughs> I don't know how many minutes I've been going on so far, but probably a little bit. Anyways, I want to talk about the gaming YouTube channel. Um, Kindergarten 2, I don't know when I'm going to finish that game. I'm probably going to finish it later this month. Uh, get all 50 of the Monster Mon cards. That's going to be really freaking tough, but I can do it. I, I, I did it with the first game. I can do it with the second game, probably. Hopefully, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to. Um, Night in the Woods. I will be playing more of that this December. Uh, Deep Dead Out, ne probably never gonna go away, cause it's such a good game. It's such a good game. It's such. A, sorry if you heard a sneeze. Jeez, my, my family sneezes loud, man. Um, Deep Dead Out is a really fun game. It's like you're a fish, and it gets updated every so often. So, <laughs> there's always new content added every now and then, which is good when you're a YouTube gamer and you're playing a game. Uh, it's good for the game that it's good for that the game gets regularly updated. Uh, I don't think Deep Dead Out is ever going to get, like, a full release. That was so close to hitting the corner, just saying. I don't think Deep Dead Out is going to ever get, like, a full official... Wait, wait, hit the corner, hit the corner, hit the corner. <sighs> um, like I was saying, Deep Dead Out is probably never going to get, like, a full official release on, like, Steam or something, because it's just a, a dead aisle game. Um, but, I mean, that doesn't take away from, like, the artistic and creativity that went into it. It's still a really good game. Um, my favorite, uh, animal in Deep Dead Out, if you've been watching my Deep Dead Out videos, you probably already know that my favorite animal is the Marlin, cause, um, he's fast, he's skinny, he's, he has a big nose, <laughs> kinda like me, all those things can belong to me, fast, skinny, with a big nose, I'm just kidding, um, that's probably my favorite animal in Deep Dead Out, my favorite character, my favorite character in Kindergarten 2, so far at least, I don't know, my my favorite character is probably Nugget. Um, he's just really cool. I mean, he was probably my favorite character even back when I played the first game. But yeah, um, Night in the Woods. So far, my favorite character is definitely Greg. I've said that during the episodes that my that's my favorite character. But uh, yeah, it's pretty epic. Uh, I just wanted to say that if there's any, I'll, I'm gonna say some games that I uh, want to play on my YouTube channel pretty soon. Uh, that I've been meaning to play on my YouTube channel. Definitely Minecraft. Minecraft is super duper popular game. Probably one of the most popular games of all time. You're not a true gamer if you never played Minecraft. Um, so I don't know why I'm going to start playing Minecraft. Another game that I wanted to play was uh, Man of Medan. It was a horror game that came out in mid 2019. It's kind of obscure by this point, but uh, it looks pretty interesting. It's not super duper long or anything. In fact, if I had substituted my Night in the Woods play playthrough with Man of Medan, I would have probably already been done with it. <coughs> And the game I want to play is Little Misfortune. It was a game that came out in late last year. Oh my god! It hit the corner! It hit the corner. That was so cool. Okay, that's the first of many, hopefully. 
Oh god, okay, that one didn't hit the corner, but it was really close too. Uh, I also want to play uh, Little Misfortune. It was a game that came out uh, late last year. It was made by the same people. Whoa. Okay, my computer... I don't know, I just... I didn't move my mouse in a long time, and my computer decided to go boop. It went. It decided to go blip, blip-blop. Um, I guess I should probably move my mouse around every so often. Um, Little Miss Fortune was made by the same people who made Franbo, which is... I've never played Franbo. I probably should play it. It's, I've heard it's a really good game. It's kind of a weird game. That's what I've also heard from it, but... Yeah, Franbo was a game that came out maybe like five or six years ago. I don't really know. I, I don't really know that much about the game, but I know they made a game called Little Miss Fortune back in late 2019. And I've heard that it's really good. Um, so I thought I might play that one sometime. I also thought I might play Undertale. Undertale is pretty old by this point. It was made back in 2016. Um, but um, I should probably play it because it's one of the more major games in the gaming industry. Uh, it has a huge fan base around it. And... I mean, I obviously I know a lot about the game, but I thought that I might as well play it for my YouTube channel, cause I'm I want to play every single game on my YouTube channel. Uh, another game that I want to play is Cuphead. Cuphead is like where you're a head, or no, where you're a little guy who can shoot, and your head is a cup, and it's kind of a retro. It's not, it's not like retro, but it kind of has like an old style to it. Sorry, I hit my microphone for a second. I don't know if you could hear that or not. It kind of has like an old style to it, and uh, I've heard it's really good. Um, <laughs> I don't know when I'm gonna get to playing that, but I've heard it's a pretty long game, so I don't know about I don't know when I'm gonna play it, but yeah, it should be good when I do get around to it. I also wanted to play uh, both South Park games, The Stick of Truth and uh, the Fractured Butthole. <laughs> um, the Butthole. Oh my God. Okay, that one was so close to hitting the corner directly, but it did not. Sadly, uh, South Park, The Stick of Truth and the Fractured Butthole. Uh, both of those games are really popular. Uh, one came out in, like, 2014, the other came out in, like, 2017. I don't know when I'm going to get around to playing them, but... I don't know, hopefully within the next year, I can play all these games. Because um, if these are the only games I'm going to be playing, then I can definitely get them done in the next year, if these are the only ones that I'm going to be doing. Um, another game that I want to play is called You Left Me. It's a pretty... I don't know how popular it is, I'm pretty sure it's pretty obscure in the gaming industry. Uh, all I know is that Jacksepticeye guy played it back in, like, early 2018. And it's only about 30 minutes, so I thought I might try it, because it looks pretty cute. Uh, you Left Me by Angela. By Angela H. Yeah, pink, purple, cyan, and yellow. No, orange. Yeah, orange, then blue. Blue, 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 then yellow, yellow, yellow. And then red, then pink. Pink, 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 purple, 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 purple. Uh, cyan, 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 orange, 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 blue, 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 uh, what's, uh, yellow, yeah, yellow, 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 red, 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 yeah, so I pretty much got that sequence down by this point. okay, well, a little bit more about my personal life, or what I, my, my personal thoughts, my clarinet, uh, well, I don't really have much to say about my clarinet, but I can say stuff about my clarinet, well, I told you a couple days ago, um, almost a week ago by this point, that I did an all-region contest. It was hard. It was tedious. It was insane. I feel like I was going to die. Um, but I also played both. I also played all the pieces that were required for it. Oh, my God. That one was so close to hitting the corner. It was insane, but it did not directly hit it. Um, I showed you all the pieces, and uh, I my results, I got... Dang it. I don't have the results directly with me right now, but all I know is that in the entire All Region contest for clarinets, I got 25th place. So that's pretty good. There's this 8th grader that I know, and he got 26th place. So as long as I beat as long as long I beat an 8th grader, I'm happy. Because that means that I'm operating at a level above my own, which is pretty good. Um, let's see, those are the sniffles that are going to stay in. I don't know if anyone's listening to me anymore. Probably not. I don't know. I, I'm not popular enough for someone to sit through this entire video. Um, just listening to what I have to say. This is like a podcast of it by yourself. This is like a really weird podcast of it by yourself. I don't know. I'm talking with this DVD logo. That's what I'm doing. You know what? You know what's my favorite food? My favorite food has to be definitely ramen. Ramen noodle soup, chicken. Well, actually, no. Uh, my favorite food is definitely pizza. Ramen noodle chicken is just something I eat a lot more often because it's cheap. It's good. I mean, I don't eat it that often because it's not super healthy, but 
you know, I'll eat it like once every couple days because it's pretty decently good. I'll eat it probably either before school or during my lunch break. It's pretty good, man. Um, ramen, 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 chicken ramen. You know what I'm saying? That's really annoying. Well, actually, no. Uh, I don't have time to talk about something that's annoying. I just need a. My lizard is over here. I'm gonna turn off his light lamp. His lightly, his light, his lightly lamp. I also wanted to say that I am currently binge watching every single Eat It or Yeet It episode. If you don't know what Eat It or Yeet It is, it's a little series on Smosh Pit. If you don't know what Smosh Pit is, it's a second channel for Smosh. That one is really close to hitting the corner. It's pretty epic. It's the, pretty much the second channel for Smosh. It's, uh... It's okay. That was also really close. Are you serious? Did you just do that to me? You jerk. <sighs> it's like the second channel for Smosh. And it will it used to be called e &H. Um... <laughs> I don't know when it was changed to Smosh Pit, but I think it was, well, it was, it was first E and H for a long time, and then it became Smosh Second Channel, and then they changed it to Smosh Pit, um, I don't, for just random reasons, each, and they have a show called Eat It or Eat It that's been pretty much pump, been pumped out, like, once every month or two since July of last year, which is over a year ago, and before I even started making videos on, on YouTube, so, it's a long time ago, pretty much, yeah, honestly. I've, like, I've been on YouTube for so long that, like, so many events and so many things have happened within my channel's lifespan. Like, uh, Team Trees happened at the very beginning of it. Team Trees, remember Team Trees, guys? Um, another thing that happened was the whole COVID pandemic. That's happened, that, that entire thing has happened within the lifespan of my channel. Um, the, a lot of terrible stuff has happened, but a lot of good stuff has happened as well. Uh, I can't name out uh, any off the top of my head, which is kind of sad, but it's just how life is, man. Also, if you're wondering what, um, if you how to see this, what I'm watching right now, I'll leave a link to the website in the description. It's called bouncingdvdlogo.com. So yeah, go crazy, you little kids, you kids, you go, you crazy kids. My fan base is probably just a bunch of eight year olds, honestly. I like, my channel is, I mean, my channel is not for kids, but I'm sure there's a, a lot of kids. Who are what? Who like watching me because I'm a kid as well, and they can kind of relate to me. I don't know. Um, I just wanted to ask any other fellow teenagers. Oh my god, that was really close to hitting the corner, man. I want to ask any other fellow teenage. Well, I'm not a teenager yet. I'm still 12 years old, but uh, I'll be. Oh my god, that was so close, you idiot! You idiot! You were so close to that. You were so close to greatness. I'm, I'm still 12. I'm gonna come 13 on May 5th of next year so i still have about six months to go i still have a little under six months to go before i become 13 officially a teenager um i'm currently 5 7 which is all pretty good considering i'm only 12 but yeah um i want to ask any other fellow kids or teenagers out there um how much do you hate homework because i hate it a lot well that's not really necessarily my question but how much do you well do you guys use imagine math and if so, do you hate it? Because I hate it. Because we have to do one Imagine Math lesson every single week for my math class. If you don't know Imagine Math, it's like a website where you th where do math. <laughs> That's pretty much the easiest way I can describe it. Um, oh my god, it's 737 already. Made it quite a ways through here. But, uh, yeah. I don't know how many minutes I'm in. I'm already like 15 minutes in. But I still have so much more to go. Oh, I hate my life. You know, I'm just gonna watch it and be quiet. I'm just gonna watch it and be quiet. <laughs> now this is content. Now this is content. Oh my wow, the wee wow wow wee wah. That was so close to hitting the corner, man. Next time could you do a little bit more oh, oh, oh no dang it. This thing is so dumb. You know what's my my one of my favorite snacks ever? Gummy gushers. Well recently my family got a bunch of gushers. Uh like little gummy things that have a bunch of like liquid in them. And they taste so friggin' good. 
But I mean, I'm probably not that healthy, so that's why I don't like to eat them that much. Well, I mean, I like to eat like maybe like two a day, which isn't very healthy. But uh, yeah, I I understand they're not that healthy. I also want to say that uh, I love, I friggin' love um, string cheese, string white cheese. Uh, it's so friggin' good, and I could have it any day of the week, man. I I used to eat them all the time when I was little, when I was like like nine and eight. Um, I used to eat them all the friggin' time. And I didn't, I don't eat them that much anymore, but they're really good. They're really, really good. Also, I don't even know what time I started, but I'm pretty sure I started at like 7.20. So I think we're already like 20 minutes in. <sighs> One third of the way to there. Okay, I'll stop at like, I'll stop in like 50 minutes probably. 45 minutes, something like that. DVD video, DVD video, DVD video, DVD video. <sighs> Man, is this a content that you 47, 46 people subscribe for? Is this is what made you push that button? If so, I feel bad. Hit the corner, hit the corner. No! Oh, was so freaking close. Okay, sorry, I just, I hit my, whoa, 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 okay, you were close, <laughs> dang it, uh, this is my reed case, that's where I hold on my reeds, boy, um, uh, clarinets, clarinetists will understand me, um, oh, what was I gonna say, dang it, I forgot what I was gonna say, I don't know what I was gonna say, man, friggin' suck, ugh, <sighs> <sighs> I'm just cracking my knuckles and whatnot over here. I do that when I'm bored. I mean, what else? Honestly, oh my god! I almost I hit my table and almost knocked down my clarinet. Sorry if I uh, have been snorting quite a bit. I, I still have a runny. I still have a little bit of a runny nose. Uh, ever since I went camping on the entire the entirety of Saturday, the second half of Friday, and yeah, and then I kind of I went home very late on Saturday. Uh, I still have a runny nose from that because it was so freaking cold. I talked about it. <laughs> I talked about it back. Uh, not back. I mean, I talked about it uh, in my night in the woods video. How it was so cold, and. Man, I still haven't recovered from it. <clears throat> my throat is fine. My throat hurt a lot, and that was so annoying. My throat is fine. It's fully recovered, I think. Well, like, 98% recovered. I still... I don't know. It's gonna get... It's, it still has a way to go. But, um... Um... Oh my god, that was so close. My nose is still... Um... My nose is still a little bit irritated from all the... All the like rubbing that I had to do because of all the mucus that came out, and this is kind of gross, but it's just it's nature's metal, man. Nature is freaking metal. Also, that hunting slash camping trip. I might as well elaborate on what I what I mean by a hunting slash camping trip. Um, I uh, I I witnessed. Well, so the people that were there was my dad. Me, obviously, because I, I just said I went there, you idiot. If you didn't remember that, you're dumb. Sorry, people who didn't remember it, now you feel stupid. <laughs> um, it was me, my dad, my uncle, and my uncle's friend. So we all went there, and we had a lot. We had a really good time. It was really fun. But uh, the part that I was going to talk about is that my, un my uncle's friend... Um, uh, skip it. Skip this part if you don't like hearing about like the death of animals and whatnot. I mean, I went on a hunting trip. What do you expect? Okay. Anyways, my uncle's friend shot two javelinas with one bullet, and he somehow killed them. That was pretty epic, honestly. He somehow kill he somehow shot both of them and killed both of them at the same time. So that's pretty epic, honestly. I also witnessed the gutting of both javelinas. Uh, gutting each one took about ten minutes. Um. Um. 
you uh, the way you got them is just you have to cut their stomach open. You have to do a bunch of... You have to, like, cut their bones and whatnot. And then you take the guts out without disrupting the meat. Because that's what you're trying to get. That's what you hunt for. You hunt for meat so you can eat it. You know? I mean, hunting, like, just for fun and not doing anything is kind of a jerk move. I mean... Honestly, I'm only 12, so I don't, I'm not really one to say that you're morally a terrible person. Oh my god, that was really close. I'm not one to say... I don't, I'm not in any position to say that you're morally a bad person, but... Just, I wouldn't hunt without eating them. I also would like to mention that my uncle's friend um, ruthlessly murdered a bunch of quail. Now, if you don't know what quail are, they're tiny little birds. Um, and apparently how you deal with them is you is you rip their head off. Uh, yeah, you heard me correct. You rip, a, you rip the little tiny bird's head off. Honestly, I've been talking about so much in this video, I don't even know what to make the description of. The description. I'm gonna. Uh, honestly, if you've been watching my channel for a long time, you probably already know that I have a handful of videos that um, the only thing that's in the description is a letter. And if you've been paying attention, well, I don't think most people have been paying attention. I don't think anyone's watching this part right now. But uh, uh, if you are, I, had, I have a handful of videos spanning from like. November of last year all the way to like September of this year. I, I need to I need to keep doing it again where I put only one letter in the description um, I have a handful of videos that are like that where If you don't know it spells out a phrase I'm not gonna tell you what the phrase is obviously. Why would I you know? Uh, plan and execute that over an entire year for just to tell you on one random video in the middle of December But yeah I'm also really excited for the Christmas spirit or Christmas season. Uh, I feel like I mean I feel like everyone's been in the Christmas spirit or season. Okay, that was really close to hitting the corner. I feel like everybody's been in the Christmas season spirit, whatever, uh, since uh, Thanksgiving ended. Really. Um. So yeah, honestly, I feel like people have been in the Christmas spirit even before. Oh my god, <sighs> that was so close, so close. That was so close to hitting the corner. Um. So, so far, it's only hit the corner once in, like, 25 minutes, which sucks, honestly. But, uh, I don't know, I'm not one to judge. I'm not one to judge. Um. Um. I don't know what I'm gonna get for Christmas. I still haven't made my Christmas list yet. I'm probably gonna make that pretty soon and give it to my parents, honestly. Uh, like... I feel like most YouTubers are like pretty rich. Well, most YouTubers that have a lot of videos. I have, I have a kind of a bit of videos, not that many, but I hope to get up there in this coming year. I feel like if you have three hundred, four. I feel like if you have five hundred videos, you're a worthy channel of, you know, having, at least a somewhat decent amount of success, unless you're like WebDriver Torso or something. But, uh, I mean, two hundred videos isn't really enough to warrant being a super successful channel, but. I mean, obviously, you can tell. I have, like, 230 videos by this point. Well, uh, I have 47 subscribers, so I don't know what that says about me. Anyways, um, well, I think I have 228 videos, but this is going to be my 229th video, so yeah. This is my 229th video. Yeah, I'm just going to stop talking and relax my throat for a bit, because I hate the way my throat feels right now. Oh my god, you're really close to it in the corner. Okay, I'm just gonna shut up now. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! That was so close, but it didn't change immediately, which friggin' sucks. That's what it is. It is what it is, man. You just have to live with it. You gotta freaking live with it. That's what you gotta do. You gotta embrace. You gotta embrace your mistakes. You gotta embrace your imperfections in order to truly uh, improve upon yourself. I'm just kidding. You need to criticize yourself, but not too harshly. And then, then only then, 
you can truly improve yourself. I don't know, man. I'm just spewing nonsense. Because I'm almost halfway through this video. And I've been running out of so many things to talk about. And honestly, I've been running out of things to talk about for like the past 10 minutes. I don't even know how. If you're still watching, if you've been continuously watching since the beginning of this video, why? 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 Honestly, that's such a good question. Um, <laughs> like, just the question of why and then the question mark. That's such a good question. There's no answer to it. There's no answer to it at all. There will never be an answer. You may create your own answer, but... There is none. Sorry. I mean, it's not really a, there's not, it's not really a question either, but you can interpret that question any way you want. In fact, that question is almost like an art piece. Why? It's almost like an art piece. Cause why what? And it's art is really <laughs> art is a really subjective thing that it almost hit the corner. Jeez, art is an extremely sub subjective thing. Where, um, oh god. No, wait. Did that change immediately? I can't tell if that changed immediately or if it bounced around a little bit. Okay, well that one didn't change immediately. Okay, then we have one. Well, okay, then if we count if you count that one, then we have two. If you don't count it, we have one. Okay? That's uh, our total count. Anyways, art is so subjective. Like you can choose to not like my videos, you can choose to like them. Either way, um some people are still going to like it. Like, you can be the most terrible, worst person. And some people are still going to like you. They're still going to be entertained by what you're doing. They're still going to listen to you. And that's kind of screwed. Kind of messed up. Kind of strange. But, uh, it's kind of how life is, man. Kind of friggin' how life is. Nice guys finish last. Nice guys finish last. That's the society we live in. I mean, I wouldn't really say I'm a nice guy, but... I mean, I'd say I've done a decent job of being a good person, right? <laughs> oh no, am I going to the Greg ex existential crisis again? I don't want to relive that moment, it was so sad. In that, in the last episode I made. Ah. Uh. DVD video, DVD video, well... Bow. Honestly, there's a lot of little, like there's a lot, there's a lot of really like short little games that I've been meaning to play on my YouTube channel for, like forever. I've always wanted to play the game Mr. Hop's Playhouse, which is a horror game that came out over a year ago in October of 2019. Uh, I've been wanting to play more Geometry Dash, except I'm terrible at it. So, yeah, too bad. Um, I've always wanted to play. Oh my god, that was really close to being an automatic switch. I've always wanted to play like. I don't know. I wasn't. Oh my god. Okay. I wasn't to play like my, like I said Minecraft. I don't know how many. I don't know how many videos I'm gonna be making on it, but still. I should make. I should probably make another Among Us video. Honestly. That needs to happen. I'll make another Among Us video soon, guys. Don't worry about it. I mean. I mean that was like the last game. That I would have expect to blow up, ever. Like, jeez. Like, um, I, like I said, I made two videos back in February of this year. I still haven't, I still haven't uh, played the poll list yet. I should probably do that, um, for a video. I, I actually, I, I've been planning to do that for a video for like a month now. But like Among Us, every single day keeps dying in popularity. So I don't know if I should make it or not. I feel like I should make it, uh, just to, you know, give the game its honor, uh, -uh. You know, five is a nice number. Rounding it off there would be decent, in my opinion. Um, I think it would be good. Probably. Bam, ba bam, 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 I don't know if I wish I was born earlier, or if I was born later in uh, the timeline of history. Because if I was born earlier, I could have jumped on the YouTube trend and created a more successful channel more earlier. And back then, like in 20, 2010, 
and 2009 and stuff, it w you could do the most random stuff ever and still build a, a successful fan base. Now, you can't really do that. You either have to have really snappy thumbnails, you have to have already been popular, you have to either collab with bigger YouTubers just to get popular, and it sucks. Like, there's a lot of really old-school YouTubers that are kind of dying because of the changes like that. Um... Matt Shea kind of being one of those examples. He hasn't died. He's not even close to dying, I don't think, in my opinion. He still gets, like, 10 million views a month. He still gets, like, 9 to 15 million views a month. Um, I mean, he's been getting that for, like, years now. But he used to get, like, like 80,000 subscribers a month back in, like, 2015 and 2016. And, well, I guess that's because he made two videos a day back in those days. Uh, now he only makes one. But, I mean, it's still a lot of content. I don't even make one video a day most of the time. Uh, but he only gets, like, 10,000 or 20,000 subscribers a month now. And that's kind of because, well, I, I think his channels, I feel like if he hopped on the Among Us trend, he would have been way more success successful, in my opinion. So, Matt, if you're watching this, you should have played Among Us, man. should have played more of it. You sh he should have hopped on the trend while it was early, like back in September, back in October. <laughs> so, yeah. Also, I, don't, I don't even know when Among Us is going to die. Fall Guys died really fast. Um, I don't know if I'm going to play Fall Guys again. I still haven't gotten a win. Maybe I should go back and just get a win real quick. Uh, you know, to do the game justice, to, to do the game honor. Uh, I've heard that there's a lot of hackers, so it's really hard to do so. Uh, to do said win, but... Oh well, I don't care. I'll do it. I'll... I'll, I'll uh, I, I don't really know how to stream yet. Uh, I'm not a really experienced streamer. In fact, videos like this should be streamed. Don't know why it isn't. I feel like I'm being recorded live right now in front of an audience, but I'm not. Oh well. I'm gonna relax my throat and not talk for a little bit while just watching the DVD bounce around. You can do the same. And just relax your face. Relax with me. DVD video, ba ba da ba, down down. Ba 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 how many minutes in am I? I think I'm like almost 40 minutes in. That's good. That's good. Don't worry, Devin. It'll soon be over. When I was like barely 20 minutes in, I was dying of boredom. And now I'm 40 minutes in. I'm not that bored anymore because I kind of learned to handle it. But now I'm just like waiting until the impending you know time is so scary i've talked to the people about this before time is just such a scary concept um a lot of people say time is, a, is an illusion a lot of people say time doesn't really exist and it's just a figment of our mind that helps us you know cope or that helps us you know understand the world around us better you know adding an element uh into the mix just helps us understand what's going on around us uh and time doesn't really exist i don't know all about that but oh my god Ah, it didn't switch immediately. It went from blue to yellow. Anyways, time is really scary because it's like the one thing that once you spend it and once it's, you know, been used, it can never ever be used or taken back ever again for the rest of, of human history, for the rest of just history ever. That's really scary. I mean, that's kind of ironic considering this is a video about me wasting my time like an idiot. I don't know. I only live so many years, but might as well spend it watching a DVD logo bounce around for one hour, if you know what I'm saying. But, um, yeah. I mean, once you're 80, you probably regret doing so many things, or you probably regret not doing a lot of things. And that's, that's really sad, because, I mean, we only have a limited time. I mean, a lot of people say life is so short, but, I mean, we really do have a lot of time. It's just whether you use it wisely or not. That's why people who, who don't regret anything... Um, 
Okay, I just wanted to give a stance on this. I don't regret any videos I've made, but I will definitely cringe at them. I don't regret anything, any videos I've made, uh, because without making that one video, I probably wouldn't be where I am today. So, yeah. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to become successful on YouTube. Probably not. Um, and if I am going to become, if, and if I am going to get any little amount of success, I'm probably going to get hit like a couple thousand subscribers and that's it. That's the end. That's the end of AUD for the rest of time. It's kind of scary to think about that if I didn't upload, like, the rest of the entire universe wouldn't even notice. If I just stopped uploading right now, no one would care. That's kind of sad, actually, but... Oh, well. I'll, I'll keep working until that until some people will care. That's my goal. I want to leave a, in a, a lasting impact on people's lives. That's what I want to do. A positive one, obviously. Obviously. Are you dumb? Obviously, man. Um... <laughs> Man, I just have scissors here. Scissors are fun. I love scissors. It's cake at steak. Cake at steak. Um, um, this is a little bit more awkward now because I really do not know what to talk about at all. And the worst part about this is that there's not even any audio. It's literally this over and over again. I don't think it's worse than the 1000 Chihuahua Spins video because that one took like an hour and 20 minutes. That one sucked, 1000 Chihuahua Spins. You probably don't know that video even exists, but it's one of my longer videos. Uh, my longest video, I'm pretty sure my longest video, as of recording this, is, I'm pretty sure it's the Rain Time Part 3, but don't quote me on that. If it's the Rain, part, rain Time Part 3, then I'm a, uh, I know my own channel pretty well, but don't quote me on that, because I may be wrong. There may have been a longer one released already. I don't know. Okay, that was really close to the corner. Ba -da 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 -da. Ba -ba 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 bum 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 after I'm done recording this I'm immediately gonna go start watching binge watching eat it or eat it also I just tell everybody that just in case you're wondering I do not have an editor I will probably not have an editor I'll probably never have an editor because I don't know how much money I'll ever be. I don't even know how I'll ever make money on YouTube. And if not, then I'm probably never going to get an editor because editors cost money, as you know. They're not going to do that stuff for free. And I, just, I edit all my own videos, and I do I, I do a decent job, I think. Um, a lot of my longer videos, I don't edit them as much because, well, for obvious reasons, but... Um, because then it'll take longer to render... It'll just take longer to edit in general. It's, it's already a pretty long video, a pretty hard video to edit considering how long it is. Blah, 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 blah. Editor talk. Uh, I don't know, man. Life's weird. Life is strange. This is another game I should play. Life is strange. Uh, I've, I've heard Life is strange is a really good game. Uh, Life is strange 2 is also alright, I've, I've heard. Um, yeah. I should probably, you know what to, you know what I should do more? I should play more mobile games. The only mobile game I've ever played is, like, Battle Cats. And I only did, like, six episodes over, like, the span of, like, five months. So, yeah. I didn't really do that series justice. Uh, I don't know if I'm ever going to come back to it. Probably not. Uh, because it was just a really hard thing to do. I didn't really like it that much. Well, I mean, it's a really, it's a pretty good game, but, I don't know, it's just so, it's a really grindy game. It's really hard. And it's going to take me a long time to actually have a good series on it. I feel like uh, my most promising series at the moment is 
obviously Deep to Dial. Um, I'm actually pl planning to make a another Deep to Dial video on the 10th. Uh, that's like my next one planned. Oh. Uh, because why not, man? Why fwee not? Why fwee not? Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 Yankee Doodle went to town riding on a pony. <laughs> it's a really good song, honestly. Yankee Doodle is one of my favorite songs. That's not like an actual song song. I don't know. One of my favorites, at least. Uh. It's another really good song. Bum bum ba da dun dun dun. Dun 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 do 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 do. Do 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 do. That's that oats, peas, and beans. Here's another song. Uh. Yeah, I made a a video a couple days ago about clarinet practice X, the tenth installment in the clarinet the clarinet practice series. It was pretty epic, honestly. It was uh probably one of my favorite ones because it's like it's like an old format. For my YouTube channel, but with new editing and a new me. I mean, honestly, I feel like my humor style has pretty much been the same ever since I started YouTube. Uh, it's just my, per I, I guess my my maturity level has increased a lot. I mean, I'm not saying I'm mature at all. I'm still 12 years old. What do I know about the world, honestly? <laughs> nothing. That's what I know. Nothing. I know nothing. I'm a little kid, honestly. I'm a little kid in the grand scheme of things, but yes. I feel like I've matured quite a bit since the beginning. I mean, if you go back... Uh, if you go back to my oldest videos, you'll notice that I have an extremely high-pitched voice. And, uh, yeah, well, that's what puberty does to you, man. Honestly, going back to, like, even videos back in September, my voice is higher-pitched than it is now. And, uh... I'm not sure... I mean, I know, obviously, I know why. It's because my puberty... It does weird things to people, and it did a lot of weird things to me. I grew a lot. I've grown a lot taller since uh, the beginning of my YouTube channel. I've grown like a bunch of inches. I think at the beginning of my YouTube channel, I was like, I don't know, I was at least like four ten or something, four eleven. Now I'm like five seven. I don't know if you believe me on that, but I don't know. I think that's pretty good. Well, I'm taller than my grandma. My grandma's like five six or five seven. So yeah, I'm like very slightly taller than her, and I'm almost taller than my dad. When I say I pass my dad, that's when you know that you've truly become an adult, a, 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 a mature person. Ow! God! Don't play with scissors, kids. Ow, I just scraped myself like an idiot. Luckily, scissors aren't nearly sharp enough to cut your skin. You need a really good scissors for that. To just, You need really good scissors to just touch the blade with your skin and to cut. You need really expensive scissors, really good sharpened scissors. I don't know why you would need scissors that sharp just to cut paper and whatnot. But still... Mm. Um. Luckily, it can't cut through your skin that easily. Well, I mean, it could cut through your skin, but uh, it could cut through your skin if you put enough pressure, I guess. But it would freaking hurt uh, until you actually broke the first layer of skin because it's a pretty. It, it, most scissors are pretty dull, so pfft. yeah. Good luck anything to get through your skin well without it being that painful until it breaks through the first layer. Just saying, boy. Just saying, homeboy. DVD video DVD. Mm -hmm.
I don't even know when the one hour mark is gonna hit be hit. Probably it well, and it's not soon, it's until it's not until like another like probably like fifteen minutes or something. <sighs> I'm just not gonna talk because I don't know what to talk about, man. Oh wait, wait, wait! Oh, oh! That was one smooth corner hit, boy. One smooth corner hit. Oh, that was so close too, but nah. The the website decided. You, Davin. We don't want you to get another corner hit that's super satisfying and everything. Honestly, the only thing that can save me from this unending boredom and sadness is another corner hit. So I demand another one by the time the episode ends. I demand it. I demand your face. I demand your mom. No, Devin, we live in a first world country. We live in a first world country. Can't buy people. That's weird. I order that you give me your house. I order that you give me your car. You know, in Kazakhstan, we like to say that a horse is like a man. If a horse, if a horse, a uh, uh, happy, happy, it is like if a man is a happy. If a horse. Is a sad sad? It is like if a man is a sad. If a horse walk, it is like if a horse walk. If you hit a horse, a horse, it's like if you hit a man. If a horse, if a horse. If you ride on a horse, it is like if you ride on a man. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm not gonna go there. If you, if, if a horse, if a horse is, um, if a horse is scared, it is like if a man is scared, 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 eh. I just did a speed run on the F minor, A minor, I forgot which one. It's the hard one. If a horse a walk on grass, it is like if a man walk on grass. That is what the man is like. That's what he is like. If you don't know why I'm saying that, it's because uh, there's a there's a Borat clip, a really old Borat clip, of a of Borat talking to like a horse feeder or something, and 
he's he's like in Kazakhstan we have a saying a horse is like a man if a horse is a sad sad it is like if a man is a sad and this keeps going on for like four minutes and it's so dumb and it's so funny man the world's a funny place dude the world is one heck of a funny place only got a couple minute more minutes a couple many more minutes that's what i like to hear that's what i like to hear that's what i love to hear man i love hearing that in fact i love hearing it i love it love it it's an asdf movie reference just in case you're wondering Just in case you're wondering. Um, these scissors are probably sharp enough. Honestly, I don't know why I keep waving these scissors around like an idiot. I'm gonna poke my eye out. Jeez. I'm gonna cut my eye or something. I don't know. DVD video. DVD video. DVD video. <sighs> Man, my mouth hurts from all these throat singings. All these throat singings. Man. <sighs> I like how this turned from like a podcast to just me complaining for like the last 20, 30 minutes. Turned into like a, a self podcast, and then it just became a really boring thing. No one's watching this part of the video. Oh my god, kitty! Well, I don't know what the heck my cat is, but okay, I heard him somewhere in this room. That's pretty epic. My cat's a gamer, just in case you didn't know, guys. It's pretty epic, honestly. It's pretty epic. Oh, very nice. Yes, <laughs> very nice, very nice. Oh, oh my god, my cat's over there. Well, he seems to be having a good time, so I'm just gonna leave him alone. Okay, I'm gonna watch the DVD thing. Watch the DVD thing. Orange, orange. Then blue, then we have a yellow, yellow, then a red, then a pink, pink, a pink, and then a purple, 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 cyan, and then we have a, a, uh, orange, orange, then a blue, 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 then a yellow, 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 then a red, a red, a red, a red, a red, nice, I love red. Then pur pink, purple. Man, what do I do for the last couple minutes? Man, what if this is the last video I ever make? And the last word I say is really dumb. That'd be really funny, right? Would you enjoy that? If this is the last video I ever made and the last thing was really fun, funny. Really fun, funny. <sighs> uh, I'm gonna stretch a little bit. <laughs> I can't wait to spend an hour making this video, waiting for it to get like 10 views or something. It do be like that sometimes. The cat is still- wait, where did my cat go? Oh my god, the cat's over here. Hi kitty. Okay, well, he yawned. I think he is enjoying himself. I'm gonna tease him. Oh, 
Honestly, I just wanted to say some one last thing. Um, I recently got into this band called Neutral Milk Hotel. I may make a video about them. They're just so good. If you if you've never heard of Neutral Milk Hotel, they're really good. So yeah, I'm just spreading awareness about them. They're really good. If you've never heard of them, just listen to a couple of their songs. Uh, some of my favorites are uh, if you're new to some of their songs, uh, definitely uh, check these out. First, uh, check the song in the airplane over the sea. Then check uh, the song O Comely. Then, uh, I don't really know. Um, I don't know. Check whatever you want after that. Maybe Ghost. Ghost is a really good song. Dang it. Happened to my computer again. Um, because it just turns off automatically because I'm, I'm not used moving my mouse anymore. Um, anyways. Yeah, those are some of the better songs. Um, Ghost, o o Comely. And the airplane over the sea. Untitled is a really good song as well. Uh, Untitled it doesn't have a title, as you can tell by the title. <laughs> uh, that was a tongue twister. Untitled doesn't have a title, as you can tell by the title. Untitled doesn't have a title, as you can tell by the title. That was not that bad of a tongue twister, but still, still, still quite the tongue twister, boy. Da, da, da. That's a little excerpt from O'Cumley. Just in case you're wondering. Deodorant. Oh, deodorant. Why do I always forget to put you on all the time? Maybe because I'm a moron but you know other than that i don't know one spray lasts all day heck yeah you know, i'm gonna put some dirty on right now i don't know if that grosses you out but i'm gonna do it i have sweaty armpits i need to do it there you go there you go gamers B gaming every day is hard okay i will say honestly i play i play among us a lot off camera and currently i have like 60 70 hours into the game yeah uh, uh, it's not that, it's not that many hours, it's a couple days, but, I mean, some people have, like, probably, like, 1,500 hours in games and stuff, and that's insane, like, why, I question the fact that you decide to do that, by far, Among Us is definitely my most played game on Steam, second is Geometry Dash, third is Clicker Heroes, obviously, fourth is, like, Kindergarten, I think, I don't know, or The Rain Time, I think, um, fifth is... It's either kindergarten or right time. Six is like... I have no idea. I don't know, man. Anyways, I've been watching this for an hour now. I'm gonna close the video real quick. Um, hope you enjoyed. If you like this video. I'm very surprised. Anyways. <sighs> I don't know if it's actually been an hour. I'm gonna wait like one or two more minutes just to make sure. Read case, read case, read case. I have a read case. Okay, I'm just gonna. I think I think it's been an hour. I'm calling it, guys. Goodbye. I'll see you in the next video. I am uh, quite dead inside after going through with this, and uh, hope you are too. Um, if you just skip to the very end of this video, I challenge you to watch the entire thing. As your soul leaves your body. Anyways. Goodbye. And I'll see you. In the next video. Bye bye. I'm Markiplier now apparently. <laughs>